If you live in the Gallatin Valley, you're probably familiar with how expensive the housing market is, even in a pandemic. m Annie Johnson joins us with answers on when or if that trend will end. It's not unusual to see a for sale sign in Bozeman, but what may surprise you is the price for housing. It's kind of wild. It's supply and demand right now, so we have very little inventory and a lot of demand. Housing in the Gallatin Valley can be more expensive than a lot of other places, but even in the last few months with a pandemic in full swing, housing here continues to be sought after. It's continued with the same momentum, if not has picked up more. Uh, you know, last time we spoke was fresh around that COVID time and we've seen even more growth since. From the outside, a high demand market may seem like the perfect scenario for realtors, but it comes with its challenges. For me, it raises my anxiety because I'm, I just, I want to get these people in a home that they love, but knowing that it, it can be a battle and it can be a challenge. So that's what's, that's what's hard. The median price for a single family home was just under 576,000 in 2020, compared to last year, which was 465,000. The difference more than 100,000 in a matter of 12 months. I hope we can find a medium for the buyers and the sellers and that, you know, people that want to get their foot in the door being a homeowner in Bozeman still have that opportunity to, but with people continuing to come here and relocate with minimal space to grow that just inflates prices. So hopefully we can find that medium, but I'm not sure if we will. Which seems to be a universal agreement. I don't think there is going to be any stopping. I don't. I honestly don't think so. Reporting in Bozeman, Annie Johnson, MTN News.